Hey, Team Catalyst. So I'm going to talk to you while I stretch post-run because coaches multitask, first rule. But I want to talk about something that I normally don't talk about. Um, I have been in a funk the last couple days, and it's something that doesn't happen often with me. It happened um, in May um, when I was in Paris, and that was kind of related to something else, but it incorporated coaching because coaching is a part of who I am now. And I really don't talk about it a lot because it doesn't happen a lot to me. But I want to share with you that it does happen. And I couldn't figure out what it was. Um, I think I was frustrated with my shoulder being out and not being able to run and an upcoming you know, half marathon. And am I going to be able to do this? And can I do all of this? Can I really grow this business? And... When I first started coaching, I, well, first I didn't want to coach. Then I didn't want to lead. Um, Sarah told me, you know, I really think that you would be a great team leader. Um, you're going to help a lot of people. And I thought, there's no way. Like, I don't want to be in management. And I, then I didn't realize that, you know, being an upline is not management. It's sharing what you're learning and sharing what you fail at. Um, and I'm happy to do that now. But it takes a lot of time. And we were talking today, I was talking to Sarah about Super Saturday, and it's coming up on Friday the 16th. And my very first Super Saturday, if you don't know what this is, it's a local event and you need to be at it. My very first Super Saturday, I was the guest speaker. Talk about crap your pants. Um, I shared my story and how, it, how my own health has changed and why I coach. Um, and it's just something that you need to be a part of. And it will change your outlook on why this business is what it is. And um, my other business, music, I forgot. And the church wasn't available. And I scheduled a party for the same night as Super Saturday. And it brought up the fear of I... First of all, don't want to give up my music class. I love being involved in the community. I love this Halloween party that I throw every year. I love the interaction with the families. It's something that I just don't want to give up, as opposed to the waitressing job and cleaning houses that I gladly gave up this year, you know, which I've been posting about on my, per my like page and my personal page, and I think that's part of my funk. Um, that stuff's scary to me, to share that, to share my income, to share how my life is changing because there's no guarantee in coaching um, and I'm rolling the dice on myself and I went to the accountant yesterday and you know because I have to pay taxes quarterly now and we had a discussion and I thought holy is it like is this really happening this is my life like I have to set up quarterly tax payments because I'm earning too much what happens if the other shoe drops and so I went for a run. Thank God that it worked. Um, running for me is therapy. Find your therapy. It might be size. It might be yoga. It might be reading a book. Um, do your personal development. That it does not count. Ex you know, you can't supplement. You have to do both. But um, I realized I was in a funk because I almost started losing touch with why I started coaching. And all these posts about money and opportunity and being uncomfortable with that made me go Oof, like my page is littered with this right now and it's because we have the coaching opportunity hall on the 14th and my page is normally not like this um, but I want to promote this and it took me a second to realize even though it's kind of out of my comfort zone and not necessarily why I coach um, it's how I started I saw Sarah posting about these opportunities for months and I watched silently and I never told her. And then I didn't believe that I could do it. And then I didn't believe that I could lead. And then I didn't believe that I would be successful. And I am. My family is healthy. I am healthy. I am successful. Whether or not I get challenge packs, whether or not I get likes on my like page, my life is better. And so that is why I coach. That is my why. That is how I reconnected with myself on my run. And now moving forward immediately it's like a reset i will be opening the opportunity for people to enroll in a kickstart challenge group without a challenge pack 
and it may or may not be a smart business decision, but for me, I want to make sure that I have something to help as many people as I can. That is why I am coaching. So I have accountability pairs. I have a long-term graduate group. I have a 21-day fix prep school group. I have five, you know, five-day free clean eating groups. And realizing that people can get a seven-day sampler of Shakeology with the purchase of a fitness program, I'm going to maximize that. And I'm going to show people the value in that week. I'm going to offer them to enroll in the 21-day fix prep school without the full 21 accountability group because those take a lot of time. Those take a lot of time to develop. They take a lot of time to read food logs. If people want accountability, they need to invest in accountability. But I was scared to invest. I, I didn't think Shakeology would work. I didn't think we could afford it. And so for all those people that I'm missing the opportunity to help, even if they don't get Shakeology. The 21 day fix is what changed my life. The opportunity to work out at home changed me as a parent. The opportunity to change my workups when I'm injured changed my physical well being. And so I leave you with this message this weekend because I am reset and ready to tackle the rest of September. I want to kill it. I want to help as many people as I can. I want to be a team leader. I want to be everything that's in my heart and the only thing that's going to stop me is me and I was in that funk so I want to make sure that if you guys are in the funk you snap out of it because you're the only one that can snap yourself out nobody's going to come and tell you it's okay Melissa you're fine you're going to be great because people do tell me that it doesn't matter it doesn't matter if you don't believe it and I am just super excited to kill this fourth quarter and help as many people as I can continue to develop my like page with meaningful posts that offer things to people because, you know, people that don't want to try the fix or people that people that just want to be inspired. That page is for them. I have something for everybody. That's my goal. So Team Catalyst is for you guys to offer you the opportunity to learn about financial freedom and working from Kohl's and it's a lot to manage. So bear with me as I develop our Coach Basics training pages. Um, It might take me a month, but I don't want to forget about my why. And I think this week I forgot about my why and it put me right into a funk. And yes, I want to help you guys, but first and foremost, and I say it in all my challenge groups, focus on yourself first. It will make you a better person. And I just needed to be reminded of that. Have a fantastic weekend. I will be limited availability because weekends are my family time. The end.